Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Savannah if you are new here and today we are continuing our not so berry challenge. I am back in my apartment so my red hair is back and everything feels right in the world. <laughs> so we are back with not so berry today. I'm excited to get into this because I think this is the episode that we're going to be leaving Sai at the altar and that is an interaction that I've done or no that I haven't done in The Sims. I don't even think I've seen it done by anyone else either so I'm excited to see uh, what goes down. <laughs> also thank you guys for leaving feedback in the comments. I really enjoy when you like um, answer the questions that I ask you in the video because it does help me decide on what I want to do because it's, it's like we're like playing together we can both kind of decide and put our inputs in so thank you so much for, for the feedback as always it's very early for me right now I am filming before class and then after class I'm driving home to my parents house again so I have a busy day ahead of me which is why I need this. <laughs> I have a strawberry guava Celsius, so if you've got something to drink, grab it. If you need to get something to drink, grab it. Let's crack this together. I'll wait for you. <laughs> I'm so excited to be filming today, though. I'm excited to see what we get up to, and uh, yeah, I wanted to build a new apartment for Rose Jen on stream couple days ago but for some reason every time I entered build mode in San Myshuno on one of the penthouses my entire PC would freeze and I had to like do a hard restart and I don't know it probably has something to do with the fact that I updated my driver that day I updated my game that day I updated my OBS that day so it was probably just not my computer was just not having a good time so <laughs> hopefully we have no issues uh, today. I'll try to resist going into build mode at all costs, but fingers crossed everything goes smoothly. All right, I'm gonna crack this open. Ooh, that was pretty good. <laughs> Cheers to you. Cheers to this video. Let's get into it, y'all. Let's go. Okay, y'all, here we are back in the bustling city of Samai Shuno. What's everyone up to? Prim is doing some yogi. We've got Sai and Amber over here just sitting at the table having a little chat, enjoying TV season premiere, I guess. I don't know. Has Amber watched the season premiere yet? No. I'm gonna get them to do that so that they, uh, they're not sad from a bad holiday. <laughs> Let me look at the calendar again, see what we got going on. So TV season premiere, tomorrow is talent showcase, and then the next day is Sai uh, and Primrose's birthday. Someone put in the comments that they're still like sad that Primrose is named after a yellow flower. I'm so sorry, like I had no idea. I just really like the name Primrose and Rose is literally in the name. So I was like, oh, that's a good name for Rose Jen. I apologize. I'll keep calling her Prim. And then after that, we have Festival Festival of Youth, but that doesn't matter. I plan on having the wedding on Sunday. So yeah, um, I would. I also asked you guys if we should kind of like age up Rose and Yellow Gen early, and it was very like half and half. Some of you were like, "Oh, that's it's okay if you do," and then others were like, "Don't speed through it. You know, take your time, enjoy the game, enjoy like doing." doing all the things and all the gens and I was like okay I understand that so I think what we're gonna do is get everything done for rose gen except for the elder wedding and then start focusing on yellow gen prim will kind of just be a background character until she becomes an elder and then we can get her married and move her out or we can move out I'm not sure yet what we're gonna do but let me remind you guys what yellow gen is all about uh, they have the ask the nerd brain aspiration and the astronaut career. They have to build a rocket um, They have to enter the secret lot in Oasis Springs and that's pretty much it So I asked you guys if we should do Oasis Springs or Strangerville and that was also very 50 50 looks like we still have servings of the flaming spaghetti left <laughs> So funny um, but yeah, it was very 50 50. Um, some of you guys said that yellow gen is like from other challenges that you've watched yellow gen is commonly played in Oasis Springs. So we should do Strangerville to like switch it up. And we rarely see gameplay in Strangerville. I personally am obsessed with the world. I think it's beautiful. And I think that yellow gen would like thrive there. Like we can even like build a really sick trailer and the rest of the lot can be like the rocket and like other things that they've like found or created or whatever. I think that would be really, really fun. And also I think that there's a mod that I can get that will 
like, either complete the Strangerville story or, like, make it so that it's not, it's just, like, gone so that we don't have to worry about all the weird people walking around. Uh, but we can make Strangerville really, really cool, like, with lots and stuff like that, like, community lots and things. I think that would be fun. So I think I just talked myself into choosing Strangerville without even realizing that I was doing that. <laughs> but, yeah, a lot of you guys were saying Oasis Springs would be cool because, like, Andy and a Amber were so close and she wanted to live where Andy lived. I get it. But, um... Yeah, I think Strangerville would be a nice change of pace. I think every gen should live in a different world if it works out that way. Um, but yeah! So, I'm just gonna get her to do a little bit of experimenting. Let's just get that skill up. One more time. Level 4 mental, let's go. Okay, now do your homework. So, with yellow gen, all we have to complete is um, the... Rocket science and handiness skill, which we can't even work on yet. When is Amber's birthday? A while. Okay, so we have a while. We have a while. And then for Rose Gen, all we need to do is max the career. We are almost there. I'm pretty sure she's going to get promoted today. We needed to max the charisma skill, which we did. And we need to... Uh... Complete the aspiration. So yeah, I am. I'm excited. I'm excited for Prim to uh, to master her career and be president. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that's the next one, right? Na national leader. It's really cool. And again, we have so much money, so we can definitely move into a penthouse at some point. Oh no, our neighbors are raging, and Andy is pissed about it. <laughs> So, oh, nope, not Andy. Primrose. Oh my gosh, guys. I, I don't know how you don't get so annoyed with me. I keep calling all of my sims different names. Never the correct one. It's found on the door. Why not? Boom, boom, boom. Shut up! You know? Shut up! Oh, it looks like he might be having a party. He's wearing bunny ears. Shh. Let's just spoil the season premiere to him. I'm sorry, you're right. That was a bit inconsiderate. We'll try to keep the noise down. Thanks for letting us know. Oops. I didn't mean to spoil the season premiere to you. My bad. My bad. My bad. I didn't realize you were going to take take it so well. My mistake. Why are you in our apartment now? Get out. Go away. Go. That was not an invitation for you to, to come inside, sir. Oh, wow. Okay. They just got negative relationship from kissing. Uh, Prim, can you, like, go to sleep or something? Like, this angry mood that you're in is not... It's not fun. It's not a good time for anyone. Okay, you've got work in five hours. You've already secured your votes. I'm thinking what we do before their birthday is, um... We should probably hang out with Olivia just to get that relationship up because I'm pretty sure that's who I want Prim to be with when they're, um... When they're elders. So... Yeah, after work, we're gonna we're gonna go hit up Olivia and see if she wants to like go out to eat or something, and we'll see how how that goes. What's Sai making? Fruit and yogurt parfait. Okay, sir. Okay. In the wedding stories trailer, I saw a teapot and some teacups, and I'm really hoping that you can like serve tea on it. I know that you can serve tea on like the tea brew maker or whatever, but the tea set is just so cute. I hope you can just set it on any surface and be like, pour the tea, pour the tea, <laughs> and then uh, like have people grab a serving or whatever. That'd be so cute, I think. I want that so badly. So give it to me, give it to me, give it to me. Does not want a pregnancy right now. Okay. Good. Because you ain't getting one, baby. Uh, you can only have one kid. What about Sai? What does he want? Does not want a child right now. Okay. Bye, Prim. Have a lovely day at work. And um, Amber, have a lovely day at school as well. Work hard. You, my love, study hard. Who's calling, Sai? Yes, what is it? It's good to hear your voice, Sai. I wanted to ask you if I should get to know Sayori a little better as a friend. They seem like good company. Um, sure, why not? I don't know who Sayori is. Do we know who that is? Barely. Really like that name, though. Oh my god! 
Look at his relationship with the freaking stuffed animal. Holy crap. They despise each other. Things have gone awry with this relationship. Can it be salvaged? I don't know. Can it? No, all we can do is rename it. <laughs> Very interesting. <laughs> I've never seen a relationship bar that bad with stuffed animal before. Ooh, after years working as a statesman, Primrose wishes to leave their mark on the assembly. They propose a grand vision to reorganize the government, but first they must be approved by their fellow members. Primrose will need to cajole or hornswoggle, but not both. Is this, a, is this a trick question? Shoot, what does my gut tell me? Why is my gut saying cajole? Cause it's, it's like cajoli and it sounds like cannoli and I say holy cannoli all the time. Ugh, I'm gonna say cajoli. Frick! It's no longer the tactic du jour. No! <laughs> I made a big mistake. Holy cannoli has failed me today. Ugh, it's oh well we're still gonna get promoted it's all good it's all good in this hood I think I can join Rose Club mm, what the heck is Rose Club again oh shoot guys what the heck is Rose Club Olivia is an elder barnacles we might have to give her a age down potion or whatever who are these people what was this for oh oh this was our debate club Right. Sai, what are you doing out there with this lady? Huh? What is this? What the? What is wrong with you? Oh, you're dry. I got you. Nasul Sul. Welcome home, Bamber. Let's get you to do your homework and experiment. Wait, health potion? What the heck is that? Let's do that. thousand dollars we made today holy crap we're president y'all we are the freaking president she will now make an additional 154 dollars an hour for a grand total of 479 per hour she also received the following bonus what the heck is stately chic i don't know i don't know but we work monday tuesday thursday friday from eight to three and we are literally the president i'm sorry as the national leader, you command the respect of countless citizens. You've clearly done something right to garner so many votes. Or perhaps you just kissed the right baby. Soak it in, you've arrived. You love to see it. Yes, you do. <laughs> Andy's ghost wants to go to the freaking festival. Oh, little Amber made the most amazing health potion. This will certainly star starve off Hummers now in Amber's inventory. Oh, it's a little cup that's cute. All right, Prim, how we feeling? How we feeling? Not very good. So, crap, we don't have any more need fixers. What are we to do now? All right, I guess we'll just take a little nap. When it hits like nine, we'll get up and go out because it is Friday. So I think that's an acceptable time. Yeah, she just needs fun and hunger, which we can we can fix when we go out. All right, nine o'clock, time to get up. Let's take a bath. What time does Sai get home? 2 a.m. It looks like Amber's just gonna have to chill by herself. I don't. I doubt she wants to come with us. I think she's old enough to be alone. What do y'all think? Seems pretty independent, an independent being. All right, Livia, where are you? Please don't die on us before we have a chance to marry you. I'm gonna be so sad. I don't think we've been to this fancy restaurant yet, so let's go there. <clears throat> hey girl, hey! You look amazing. Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. I, I feel the need to maybe age her down. It only makes sense because Alice and Uh, 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 Alice and God, my brain! Ah! Alice and Andy were besties, and they had their children around the same time, right? I think so. I'm gonna age her down. If you guys feel like that's too much of a cheat, let me know, and I will definitely, I'll definitely uh, change her back. But for now. 
We just gonna, we just gonna age her down real quick. Wait a minute. If she's president, does that make her like a little bit famous? Oh my God, she looks amazing by the way. Look at her. Wow. They both look, they both look good. They both look so good. Okay. What the heck is wrong with you? Oh, noisy neighbors. Oh, you, can you work on your skill? Build skill. Mental. Don't burn the house down. Okay, great. Thank you. Don't burn the house down. Thank you. Can I get a... Table? Let's eat outside. What is happening here? Why can't we get a table? I don't know what's going on, but we can't claim a table at this restaurant for some reason. So, let's go somewhere else. That's unfortunate. We can go to the Strangerville restaurant that Andy and Alice used to always go to. My restaurants might be broken, actually. I wish this was my real hair, guys. It's so pretty. A lot of you guys have been asking me as well, like on my most recent videos, because I haven't been wearing wigs. Yeah, that, so that's my actual hair there. Yeah, I've gotten a lot of questions about it, actually. Okay, let's see if we can request a table here. Thank goodness. Gosh, I love this restaurant so much. It is so cute. They kind of match a little bit. Oh, they're so cute. I love them. Ooh, Schwabi. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you so much. Okay, let's what up. Swarpa. Swarpa. All right. It's Prim that doesn't like drinking, right? If I remember correctly. <laughs> I'm gonna get her sparkling apple juice and I'm gonna get red wine for Olivia. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Let oh, it's like all breakfast. Guess we can just both get a veggie burger. That sounds pretty good, actually. Very casual. I'm just trying to get their relationship up a little bit. Yeah, I'll have sparkling apple juice and a veggie burger, please. Why are you guys talking to them? Talk to each other. I guess this makes sense. She's the president and everyone just wants to talk to her. So like everyone's just joining in on their conversation. <laughs> I just wanted this to be like a quiet dinner with just them two to get to know each other better. But I mean, the more the merrier, I guess. Look at how pretty. So cute. What is this? Snobbly surrounded. Snob sims love to be in the presence of other snob sims. Elitist Unite. Wait, who else is a snob? Well, it's not Olivia. I wonder if it's Marissa. Analyze her personality real quick. Cheerful, world-renowned actress and waterproof. Okay. Oh, our freaking host just aged up. Why does this always happen to us? Why do random Sims always freaking age up in front of us? Like, just randomly. It's so funny. Why did she get her burger and not us? Also, where are our drinks? Why do restaurants have to be so bugged? Okay, literally, who is the other snob Sim, though? It has to be the buns lady. Benorba KB Sebo. Well, if you're not gonna eat this veggie burger, I will. Thank you. Well, we've been here all night. I think it's time to go. We didn't get our drinks or a burger, but Olivia, it was really great to see you. Goodbye. Our relationship. Is it full? It's full. Good. Great. Fantastic. That is what I wanted. And we networked a little bit with some, uh, with some people, get to know our uh, constituents, I think is what it's called. <laughs> hey babe, how was your night? Are you okay? Let's cuddle her. No. Sorry I was out. Hopefully dad took care of you while I was gone. Cute. Is she watching the kids channel? She is, that's cute. Well, let's make breakfast then for her. Let's make pan clocks, of course. Or should we do something different? Should we do um, French toast? I always make pancakes, but never French toast. It's the weekend too, so we don't have work. So nice. Oh, it's our birthday today. What shall we do? I don't know if I wanna to go to another restaurant because it was so bugged. 
Maybe we can just have a nice night in. Amber, you didn't even eat any of the French toast. Get some. You know what? Let's actually go out for our birthday. I think that would be way more fun, especially for Amber, who really never gets to get out of the house. Um, You got work today? No, nah, let's take some paid time off. And then let's get you up. Go to the bathroom. And we can all travel, invite some people out. Maybe we can like go bowling or go to karaoke or something. Let's do that. I have a cake. I didn't forget this time. So what do we got? We got a nightclub. We got a cafe. We got, oh, Pizza Planet. Yeah, that's where we went for Amber's birthday before. Let's see what else we have. All I did was place bars and restaurants apparently. <laughs> What's in Newcrest? Oh, there's plenty of stuff here. What do we got? Cafe. Oh, we can go bowling. What's this? Bakery. Movies. Oh, a po the pool? Let's go to the pool. I think that would be fun. I probably should have checked what season it is and what the weather was today, but it's fine. <laughs> I don't think it's winter and that's all that matters. <laughs> okay, uh, it is summer, but it's freaking raining. Oh my god, just our luck. This is really cute though. Yeah, I like this. This is cute, but it's raining guys. It's freaking raining, but they're going in the pool anyway. Oh my god, cute. They all jumped in. <laughs> Wait, that's adorable. What is this? Swim angry laps? Okay, this is really cute. I mean, it's warm outside and it's raining. I don't know if you guys have ever been in a pool when it's warm and raining, but it's like, it's a big vibe. I did it in Vegas once and I was like stoked about it. It was just a very like surreal experience for some reason. I don't know, it was fun. I'm gonna invite, I'm gonna invite Olivia over here. Oh, who's this? Did you make a friend? Ralph Peppers. Okay, Ralph Peppers. Uh, let's just enthuse about candy with him, I guess. I don't know. <gasps> Wait, another person. Oh, he's swimming in a tracksuit. Uh, perhaps we should introduce ourselves to him because he seems a little, uh, a little interesting. He's swimming in a pink tracksuit, socks, and pink glasses. I'm, I'm intrigued. I'm intrigued. Uh, sir? Brendan, do you want to be friends, maybe? Okay, Sai is hot. I forgot, but it's fine. I'm not. I'm not gonna get. I'm not gonna get attached. I'm not. Wait, stop! This is so cute. She made a friend. He looks really sad though. What's the matter, Brendan? Splash! I didn't realize that was a thing. Console about death? Oh no, he lost someone. Wait, we lost someone too. Aww. I think she cheered him up. Aw, oh, yeah, this is hella cute. I'm stoked about this. What is this? I love fitness. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Well, I'm gonna grab the cake before I forget. Uh, let's do it over here on this table. This seems like a good spot. Let's age up Psy first. Aw, oh, Brendan likes retro music. Cute, I do too, Brendan, same. Big same. Well, happy birthday, Sai. You know? Happy birthday, bro. I don't know what to say other than that. All right, Prim, your turn. Time to be adult. Time to adult. Let's go. Yeah, this is such a weird birthday, but I'm okay with it. <laughs> okay, birthday, birthday times. Oh, look, senior pollination technician number three sent us a gift. That's uh, that's our alien mom. Yes, who's calling? Uh, charity, I guess. Yeah, yeah, we're president. We probably should. I'm so happy that uh. Our babe here made a friend. Did he leave already? Oh no, he's still here. Maybe, do you want some cake? Just call him over. I wish he could like offer, you know, offer a slice. You want cake, sir? I like that he's a unique color as well. Maybe that is why they kind of gravitate towards each other. 
Prim looks happy. You know what would be really cute too? If uh, there was like a social interaction on Sims birthdays where you could like say happy birthday to them or something like that. Like you know how you can enjoy company on Thanksgiving or like share holiday spirit or whatever. I wish you could do that on birthdays. There's another child over there. Who is this? Who are you? I kind of like the idea of just having one friend though. More, 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 Mariah? I think that was a pretty cute birthday, guys. I am satisfied with how today went. I'm kind of feeling sad about breaking up this family now for some reason. Like, that was such a cute day, but you gotta do what you gotta do. All right. We are an adult now. The clarity, the midlife crisis. She seems happy, but yeah, I don't know. It's wedding day, y'all. It's wedding day. It is time. We already gave her her outfit, right? Let me just double check. Oh, no, we didn't. We didn't give her a wedding outfit yet. Okay, let's go ahead and do that. She is perfect. All right, let's find you something for your wedding, my love. Oh. Um, the president's getting married. I wonder if it would be like a large affair or if she would like keep it... Keep it small. Also, do we dress her in white or red? <laughs> oh my god, that is so gorgeous. I love this. I wish it came in red. Maybe we should just do white. This is so pretty too. Oh, that neckline. Oh, barnacles. This is very wedding. Very proper. Yeah, that's really pretty. Let's see how it looks with the veil. It's pretty amazing that there's no veils in the game yet. <laughs> I'm sure there'll be some with the uh, new pack, but... Uh, I don't like it. Oh, that's pretty, though. A little sprig in, in the hair, in the bun. That's really nice. Oh, that's freaking gorgeous. <laughs> I'm obsessed. What the heck? I actually think I liked the, uh, this the best. And it comes in different colors, too. Okay, I think we'll do that. Let me change her lip color to something that kind of matches it more. Like, maybe, like, a deeper red. Maybe some classic French tips. Okay, pretty. I like it. Okay. And then Sai, I don't think... I think he has a red suit that we can keep already. Yeah, this is good. I like this. And then Miss Bamber... What you got for your formal? Aww! So cute! Okay, perfect. We're ready. And I placed a red wedding venue in Mount Kamarebi. So, yeah, that's where we're gonna get married at. Or, married. That's where we're gonna wreck our relationship. <laughs> I'm very excited to see what this interaction is like. Real! Parenting level 5? Stop it, Sai! Stop making me like you now! It's annoying! God, why are they always so angry? Oh! She is hot- They're both hot-headed! Oh my god, I didn't even realize that until now. That is a recipe for disaster. He's good, but he's hot-headed. Oh lord. No, 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 no. Imagine having two hot-headed parents that just constantly argue. I'm wondering if we should invite our our uh, our other mom to the wedding, like senior pollinator technician, whatever number three. <laughs> Would that be weird? Maybe they found out about the wedding and wants to like surprise Prim. I don't know. That could be kind of fun. And Amber could have. Amber could have another grandparent to be close with, who is full alien. Wait, that could be kind of cool. I think I might do that. Maybe she just comes down, she comes down to Earth every so often just to say what's up. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna invite her. I'm, 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 I'm intrigued. Now that Andy is gone, uh, it could be kind of cool. Oh, Prim has a bad relationship with Bud. Oh, well, we gotta invite our brothers. Hank, Bud, and Thorn. Kind of forgot they existed, I'm not gonna lie. I'm just gonna invite everyone that we have like a good relationship with that we don't have romance with. This is gonna be an interesting looking wedding. 
Here we go. I'm excited. Okay, rain. I do not accept. We're gonna have a sunny wedding, okay? Okay. So, I appreciate that you're in red, Prim, but it's the wrong, it's the wrong red. <laughs> Dress is looking kind of nice though. Oh my god, there she is. Why am I nervous? I'm so nervous right now. This is her. Look at this fit. Oh my god, she's like, Okay, she's an icon. I definitely see what Andy saw in her to get abducted that many times. Because, wow. An actual smoke show. Holy crap! Hold the phone! I'm so excited right now. So we already know her because it's our other mom. So we have like... Dang it, I didn't mean to make it a gold event. So we automatically have relations with her, but like, this is like the first time that we're actually meeting her. So let's just thank her for coming. Um, oh my gosh. Hi. Hi. Thank you for coming. I am obsessed with her. She is, she, she doesn't look very happy to be here on earth, but. She's like feeling you're tense about it. Bay. She's like, so you're prisoner of the world, huh? Sure shot. Oh no, she's on her period on her wedding day. Oh man, I'm so I'm so sad for you right now. We didn't have any tampons or pads, so I had to ask Shania here for a tampon. She's going, oh, why is everyone, why is everyone cloud gazing right now? Whoa! Okay, we got a ghost with a bag over his head, but like, dude, what is happening here, Thorn? He is really taking this, um, alien thing to a whole new level, bro. What in the world? I'm obsessed, but like, wow. Wow. Aww. Nice lashes, cutie. Oh my god. Stop. Stop. Wow. She is everything I aspire to be in life. Everything. Nice flowers. Look at you. So cute. Oh. <gasps> You guys! Oh my god, the cutest. Anyway, I'm gonna need you to introduce yourself to, G to G Gam Gam here. Let's do a respectful intro. This is a big day. I'm very excited that, uh, excited that Senior is here. Hi, Grandma. Hello. Nice to meet you, little. They're both stressed. I wonder if they're both loners, and that's why. Yes. Graham, what's your favorite color? Dislikes brown. Well, that's not your favorite color. It's what you don't like. Discuss fractions with the alien as well. Okay, what are you up to? You got your you got your tampon in. Um. Okay, well, I guess we should do this thing then. Um, so this isn't a proper wedding arch. I have to buy one? Okay. Okay, there's lots of people here, but I doubt any of them are gonna actually watch the ceremony. Alright, you guys ready? What the heck do you mean? He's right here! Okay, get married. Okay, there they go. She's got cramps and they're standing the wrong way. Okay, wait! Are people- okay, people are- people are actually sitting. Holy crap. I'm- I'm- I'm so scared. I'm so nervous right now. I'm- I'm scared that I'm not gonna- Oh my gosh, yes, we actually have a musician as well. I don't know why I'm like rooting for this wedding to be successful because it's- It's not supposed to be. Okay, let's, uh, call it off. Oh god! I said call it off! Why are you- what? 
I said call it off. I said call it off. I swear if this doesn't work. No. No. First kiss? What do you mean first kiss? What happened? Did I wait too long? I heard the I heard the music. Oh my god. I guess the next best thing that we can do is divorce right here. I'm so annoyed that it didn't work. What the heck? He's like, what do you we literally just got married? <laughs> <laughs> Is this the same? Okay, let me try something really quick. I'm so annoyed right now. Hold on. Oh, dang it. I asked him to be my boyfriend and it counted towards the aspiration. Ah! I'm sorry this is so chaotic, but I want to try to do this again because I want to see like the actual interaction all right they're engaged again so let's give this whole wedding thing a try okay round two call off the wedding quickly quickly before progressives yo this is the most chaotic thing I've ever seen Oh my god. Oh, and the cramps are hitting. Oh, and Sai is falling asleep. Literally falling asleep. Really? That's it? She just kind of yells at him? Uh, mom, what do you think about that? What is your... I think she's living through the chaos. She's like happy now. She's no longer tense. Yo, that is... That was so underwhelming. Dodged a bullet. Just narrowly avoided a very serious relationship. Oh my god. Man, I was hoping that Sai would like run away crying or something like that. I'm actually shook at how many people sat. Let's come over here and hug Olivia. And maybe like go here and like call her over. Actually, go here behind this building. We hired a caterer and they didn't even cook. Hey, Olivia, come here, come here, come here. I have something I want to tell you. She's hungry too. They're both so hungry. Oh my God. I have something I want to tell you. Hey, get out of here. Oh my God. This is a private conversation. Look at Olivia's face right now. Okay. Makes him leave. You got to go. You got to go. You got to go. I need to take a screenshot of this. Oh no. Don't be embarrassed. Get out of here, please! This is a very serious conversation. Go! Nothing ever works out the way that I wanted to. Like, I'm just trying to have a private conversation with Olivia right here. And whoever this is, Skyla, you're just ruining it. Get out of here! Go! Dude, I'm about to delete her. For real, I'm not even joking. Okay, she's gone. I reset her and she's gone. No! No! Oh my god. I just wanted to tell Olivia how we felt. In private. It looks like the caterer finally cooked something. Just one thing, though. God, what a disaster. What a disaster. I don't know why everyone is still sitting. Yeah, everyone enjoy enjoy the venue while we you can. We spent the money on it, so all right. Finally, some alone time. Dang, dude. Okay, let's see what we can do here. Let's do a bold pickup line and see how she reacts. Oh, okay. She liked it. She liked it. She liked it. She liked it. Okay. So I imagine that she's here just telling Olivia that- Oh no, what's this from? Slip through my fingers from people, person, lifestyle. Ew! And why do we get a gold medal on that wedding? 
what a wedding indeed but like why did we get gold that was so bad i want to give you a zero <laughs> I'm so disappointed with the leave or call off wedding interaction. That's boring. Come on, let's go home. Come on, Amber, let's go. Come on, Sai, let's go. For some reason, he's not sad about it. He's just angry. I'm pretty excited that we got to know our other grandma though. I really, really hope that the new wedding pack fixes all the wedding bugs. Like, fingers freaking crossed. So I think that after hanging out with Olivia that one night, she realizes that she's in love with Olivia and not with Sai. And she felt pressured to marry Sai just because they have Amber. But now that Amber's a little bit grown up, she feels like maybe it's not necessary to be married, that she can be, they can co-parent. She seems okay. She doesn't have any sad moods at all. She actually doesn't feel anything. She's just pissed because she's on her period. Um, she's riled up. She feels nothing. She feels absolutely nothing. So I think that we made the right decision. I would really like to make Olivia our girlfriend. I'm so excited we got to finally meet Senior Paul, Paul, Pollinator, Pollinator, whatever. I can't ever say it correctly. <laughs> she's an absolute icon. That, that outfit that she was wearing, holy cannoli. Oh yeah, we also need to convince Olivia to leave her spouse as well. You know what would be funny if our <laughs> our next two boyfriends and girlfriends were Kazuki and Lacey? Because they're married to each other? I don't know why I think that would be funny. I don't know what I'm saying. Ignore me, please. Just ignore me. Let's do, um, let's do Danielle here. Danielle is not married, so I think that's a good, that's a good sim to, 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 to cuff. You know what I mean? Oh, she's here already. Hi! Hello, hello! Just do a heartfelt compliment. Yeah, I think uh, I think she's gonna be our, our next victim. Oh my god, social level nine? Amber, are you serious? Wow. You're doing really well with your skills. I'm very proud of you. Well, when Sai gets home from work, oh my gosh, he left that altar. He's so pissed. He is so pissed off right now. And Primrose is just like, meh, it is what it is. <laughs> so when Sai gets back, I'm gonna move him out. Um, probably somewhere else in Semi Shuno so that Amber can visit him whenever she wants. Um, Cause I don't really want him around while Primrose is doing her thing and completing her aspiration. Oh, and he got promoted. Well, I hope that brightens your day a little bit, sir. All right, time to split from household and move. Uh, Primrose was probably like, I don't want you here when I get back from work. So please get your things and get out. I don't know, do you think that they would have a good relationship? Let's give him 15,000. I think that's only fair. Or 10. Because he did make some money from his job and things like that, so. Oh. I'm not gonna lie, I feel bad. You know what? Should we move him in next door? Would that be weird? Or should we move him into the building next door? Maybe the building next door. It's a little less intrusive. <laughs> Okay, welcome to your new home. You've got a karaoke machine, you got a living room, a nice kitchen. Look at how close the TV is to this couch. <laughs> and why is this chair right? Anyway, you've got a bedroom and you've got a, a pretty nice kids room actually. I, I actually really like this apartment. I like this layout, I like the vibe of it. I don't know why I don't play in here more often. This would be pretty good for... Oh, and it even has a balcony. We could make this apartment like super nice for Prim and Amber, actually. But I think maybe penthouse is more more fitting. Okay, sir. Well, good night. Even though... Even though she left you at the altar, you guys still have kind of a good relationship. Deeply in love and deeply wounded. Infuriated about canceled wedding. Furious sentiment, oh lord. Awkward. 
All right, guys, I'm gonna go ahead and leave this part right here. I hope that you enjoyed it. It was uh, chaotic as per usual, but we got the freaking wedding out of the way. I was kind of dreading it. I don't know why. It was just, I expected it to be so much more dramatic than it was, but um, honestly, I was more stoked about meeting our, um, Primrose's other mom. She's so iconic. <laughs> so in the next episode, we're gonna focus on getting Prim her last partners. And then once that's done, all we'll need to do is wait until she ages up into an elder and then get her married to Olivia, hopefully. Hopefully the, hopefully their relationship uh, grows pretty easily and hopefully they get along romantically. Uh, we're gonna need to get Olivia, or we're gonna need to convince Olivia to leave her spouse as well. And then after that, we're just gonna focus on, on Amber, maxing, maxing their skills. Um, and let me know what you think about the whole Strangerville situation, like living in like a really nicely decorated trailer um, and just like doing the next part of the Let's Play in Strangerville. I think it would be fun because like someone said, you rarely see gameplay in Strangerville on YouTube and it's one of my favorite worlds. So yeah, let me know. I love you guys so much. And if you would like, follow me on Instagram, Twitter, and TikTok, and I will see you in the next video. I love you so much. Bye!